What is up, Waterboy gang? Welcome to the Waterboy vlog. Today's question is, what is your favorite candy? In the comment section below, let me know what your favorite candy is, and at the end of this vlog, I will let you know my answer to that question. But anyways, gang, let's get the vlog started. I've been flying from town to town, from London to Taiwan. I've been all around the globe trying to protect your soul. Good morning, Waterboy gang. Welcome to the Waterboy vlog. Today, I think, is going to be a better day than yesterday. Brayden, Brayden, you want to tell him what time you slept, Del? What time did you sleep, Del? Anyways, Brayden actually ended up sleeping till like 9.30 this morning. He woke up at about 4 a.m., uh, fed him, and then he went back to bed and he slept till 9.30. So, you should be in a good mood today. We should have a lot better day than yesterday, right? Today, uh, I gotta take Brayden out and we gotta go run some errands. We gotta run errands, buddy, okay? So you gotta be in a good mood today. Got her? You got her? You got her? Alright. I'm gonna stop rambling and we're gonna get into the meat and potatoes of our day here. So let's get her started. <laughs> so, uh, Brayden has gotten a lot better at crawling and moving around and he can get kind of wherever he wants to go now. Which means that he can get into pretty much anything in the house and uh, Brayden, do you want to show, you want to show our friends, the Waterbug gang, what you just did? Should we show them? You crazy kid. Okay, here's, here's Brayden's latest, uh, disaster. He pulled over the DVD cart after he pulled out all the DVDs. Oh, boy. Buddy, that's pretty, uh, pretty impressive. Well done. You gotta pick that up. I ain't cleaning up after you. Oh, you got clean that one up. What do you think? I do. <laughs> you think what? I do. All right, dude. You ready to go run our errands? You ready to go run our errands? Woo! Basically, the main errand that I actually have to run. I actually just have to run to the grocery store and pick up some candy bars for the high school musical kids that helped make the Target thing for that carnival that we did uh, last week. I'm gonna bring them some candy bars because they had the option of staying and helping or going home. And certain kids stayed and helped instead of going home early. So to show, to say thank you, Brayden, we give them food. Cause food is the greatest gift of all. Do you agree? You do agree? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Damn, it's nice out here. Brayden, I think we might have to go for a little walk with Brody later. We ain't letting him off the leash cause last time I did that, he went running into those woods down yonder. I spent about uh, an hour finding him and then bringing him home and figuring out where I was. And I got lost in the woods. It sucked. I hate filming in public like this. Don't you? I just feel like it's so awkward. People are gonna like yell at me or something. Just get candy bars, get out, get candy bars. It's like a lot of people that I actually like know here. So this is awkward. Get out, Brady, get out, get out. Yeah. <laughs> now we gotta see what kind we need to get. Okay, there. Yeah. I think we got it all. Thank you. Perfect, thank you. you. Thanks, you too. See you, bye bye. Oh, thank you. Yeah, <laughs> it's something you see. <laughs> you guys ever seen the movie Benchwarmers? The uh, character that Nick Swardson plays, who, by the way, from Minnesota, Duluth, I believe. The character that Nick Swardson plays, <laughs> he's like afraid of the sun. That's Brayden. Brayden is not like the sun for some reason. Whenever we go out in the sun, he's just, he's not feeling it, man. <laughs> oh, very successful uh, ugh, candy bar trip. We'll give those to the kids tonight. Sure, all the other kids that don't get one are gonna be like, oh, why don't I get a candy bar? Why not me? I want candy. All right, gonna get some lunch going here, and uh, you know, since I can't work out due to the rip issue, what I eat is going to really matter this week. So I'm trying to eat like super healthy this week, because abs are made in the kitchen. Am I right? So what I'm gonna make right now is uh, got some tilapia. Yep. Farm raised tilapia fillets. And what I'm gonna do is throw together some garlic powder, sea salt, chili powder, olive oil. I'll try it. I don't know. Cooking with the water boy. Always sure to be an adventure. 
We'll give her a try here. All right, guys, so let's uh, let's run through this recipe really quick, just in case. Maybe you want to try and do this once too. Um, cue some uh, cooking music for me, please. Okay, so basically, this is just this is just uh, olive oil, and we're in, just gonna put it, just paste it on there. Super simple. You're gonna want to do this on both both sides. Okay, and then once that's done, all I did here was combine chili powder, garlic powder, and sea salt. And basically what we're gonna do is we're just gonna sprinkle it over the fishies. Okay, so basically once we have that, we have our oven set at 425 degrees. Take that bad boy, pop her in there, and just throw it in there for like 10 to 10 to 12 minutes. We'll see what the finished product looks like. Be right back. All right, let's take a look at, ooh, yeah. Ooh, smoky. Ah! Almost lots of fishy. Smells delicious. Looks good. A real test. Let's see how it tastes. All right, here we go. Let's give, uh, let's give this fishy a little taste test. Yeah. I'm nervous. I always hate trying new foods. Wow. It's actually really good. Chili powder tastes really good with it. I approve. All right, now the real taste test. I don't think he's gonna like this. What do you think? You like it? I think he likes it. It's impressive. You know it's good if the baby will eat it. All right, guys. So since it is a actually pretty nice day out, I'm gonna give the whole uh, walk the baby with the dog walk. A little bit of a try here. Brains all bundle up. Are you ready for a walk? It's Minnesota warm, which is like 39 degrees, but uh, we'll keep baby warm. You know, I know I, <clears throat> I know that a saying in other states is sun's out, guns out. It's not like that in Minnesota. Minnesota, it's sun's out, no coat, just sweatshirt. Kinda sucks. So these are the woods that Brody actually ended up taking off through a couple weeks ago. And I actually had to go running through those woods trying to chase after him. He got on the scent of something. Went all the way through the woods. Ended up on the other side, like the other tree line. I'm standing there and this whole, I mean look, this whole thing is woods. So he could be literally anywhere. I might not even be close to him. I'm standing at the other end of the tree line. Kelly's back home. I'm ready to like go back home and say, Kel, I lost him. Like he's gone. And then all of a sudden I hear like a little jingle. So it's like his collar. And I look and I see a tree move. So I go sprinting back through the woods. And I see him, and he's chasing something. So I'm chasing after him, he's chasing something. It's the circle of life. I lose my boots, because my boots aren't tied. I just slipped them on quick. Thought we were going for a nice little stroll. So I'm running through the, through the woods. This was a while ago when it was colder yet. It was only like 20 degrees. There was a lot of snow yet. So I'm running through the woods, in the snow, and just my socks. As soon as I get close enough, I dive and just tackle Brody and finally get him to stop. I hook him up to the leash. We have to trudge through the woods all over again. And then in the middle of the woods, there's a little house that I've never seen before. Didn't even know I was back there. So I'm like freaking out like, oh my God, I'm gonna die today. The whole thing lasted about an hour, hour and a half. I finally found my way back home. I get inside, Kelly's inside with Braden. I'm just drenched, my socks are soaked. You know that feeling when your socks are soaked in your shoes? Yeah, I, I did that for like an hour. The whole thing was actually filmed on my uh, Instagram story, so if you don't follow me on Instagram, <laughs> you're missing out. Instagram handle, at Waterboy Walters. Follow it. But needless to say, it was quite the, uh, we'll call it an adventure. Yeah, we'll go with that. It's a candy man. The candy there you go, man. sir. Thank you. Thank you. He mixes it with love and makes the world taste good. Yeah, I can't. Who can take a rainbow? I think you're vlogging. Yeah. Did you? <laughs> you guys did a good job. <laughs> What's up, Waterboy Gang? <laughs> <laughs> We're at musical practice right now. Speaking Chinese, just and left. It's your boy Bun Fu here. What? Okay, so he can't know about this. So. Peace out. Oh my god, he's so busy. It's recording. Yeah. It is? Yeah. Well, turn the camera around. Hey, what's up, you guys? Yes. What's this up? This is. Water, what is it? Waterboy? It's Waterboy Gang. Gang? Okay. I can't. Gang, gang. Okay, okay. I go first. Turn the camera around. <laughs> Are we a squad or a gang? So... No, he calls it the Waterboy Gang. Right, Justin? <laughs> <laughs> Question of the day. Oh, yeah. People who. Is it Waterboy? Watch... 
Waterboy squad or Waterboy gang? Tell us what you think in the comments. I mean, I'm I'm a hundred percent sure it's Waterboy gang. Leave, like sure it. Leave a like in the comments if it's Waterboy gang or a comment it's in Waterboy the gang. comment. Hi hey guys, guys, we're just vlogging on our daily walk through yes, the school. Our daily walk. <laughs> um, just wait. Do you hear that? Oh my god. Oh my god. What was that? Was there something that over was... here? Oh my god. Hello? Oh my god. Did you hear that? Yeah. Take the camera. Be careful. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. I don't know what to do. Carter, Carter. So my answer to the question at the beginning of the vlog, which was, what is your favorite candy? You know, I'm not, I'm actually not too huge on candy, but if I had to pick, I think my favorite candy would be Runts. I enjoy the Runts. Runts with a, with a T, not without the T. Y you get the point. And gang, that is going to do it for today's episode of the Waterboy Vlog. If you like this channel, make sure you subscribe down below to become part of the Waterboy Gang. Hope you enjoyed this episode, a little uh, guest starring of the episode with some uh, high school kids. It's one thing I love about vlogging, like trying to get content every day. It, during the musical, I can just give the kids the camera and they'll, go, and they'll end up doing the stupid stuff instead of me. It's free content. So big shout out to the guys that actually did that. You guys did awesome, well done. Make sure you tune in tomorrow for another exciting, you tickle at my toes, dude, you tickle at my toes. Make sure you tune in tomorrow for another exciting episode of the Waterboy Vlog. And until then, remember gang, stay true, be you. I'll catch you later. In three, two, one, go. So tell me, what's your story?